Hello, my loves. I know that this is probably not the best quality because this is my cell phone, but I am currently, oh, oh no. Okay, well, that's fine. I am currently going from one client site to the next client site because it's a busy Monday, of course. Oh, I look like shit. I don't know why, but I feel like on my cell phone, you can just tell I look like shit more than you can on my Super HD cameras, which is very weird. But um, I just wanted to, I guess, do a little vlog for you guys. I drove from Arizona this morning straight to the client site, and now I'm driving to another client site, and then I will finally be going back to San Diego. I've been in Arizona for the last week. I drove out here, not this last Sunday, but the Sunday before that. So I've been out in Arizona for over a week. Um, you know, my dad's doing good now. Those of you who follow me, you kind of know what, what's been going on. Um, I don't really want to post too much about it because my dad's very like, don't be posting about it. Kind of got in trouble for posting about it. But um, he's doing better and he is home. So that makes me so happy. So of course I was like, okay, I can go back home now. They got it from here. My stepmom's got this. My nephew's got this. So I will go ahead and go home to my dogs. I freaking miss Ayla so much. Like... I've literally been talking about her like all week and I miss her a lot. Like she probably doesn't even know who I am anymore and she probably hates me, which I deserve because I left her for a whole fucking week by herself. Well, not by herself. Like we had someone watching her, but I miss her. It's been it's been a minute, okay? I want to see my dog. I just decided that I would like I don't know, vlog. I guess I want to try to do vlogmas i don't know if it's like the 12 days of vlogmas or if people just vlog like every day until christmas i i don't really know how this works i haven't really done this i've always wanted to but i've never done it so i don't know you guys can let me know maybe i'll look it up i might google it if it's like every day until christmas then you'll probably be seeing this if not you'll see this around you know the first of the 12 days i don't know we'll see my life is pretty boring uh during the week because all I do is work so you'll probably see a lot of that it's not gonna be the most exciting but maybe I can kind of factor in some outfits or something like that to keep it fun and yeah I also did a little bit of shopping today I got my two little secret Santas their gifts plus I got Cody a gift well one of his gifts for Christmas and then I got myself something because hello Cyber Monday I got oh my god i got this little usb thing super nerdy i know i honestly like guys i ate mcdonald's for breakfast because i was like oh i'm on the road like i just need to get food and go mistake every time i eat fast food i swear i don't know why i did it it's really making me upset that i did that but it is what it is i don't know why that guy's just stopped there it's interesting hopefully he's not a cop no he's not a cop he was just waiting for me that's weird i wouldn't have waited i would have just kept going but I'm an asshole driver, so that's probably why. So yeah, I, uh, what was I talking about? Oh, I ate McDonald's and it, and a half mile. Right on West Street. it did not sit well in my tum tum and my tummy's been hurting and I've been burping up a storm and it's been really hard to contain. And I've been at the client site, which has made it harder. But yeah, now I'm in Holtville. I've never been in Holtville before. I've always passed it. I'm always like, Holtville, what the hell is that? But here I am. Holtville, Arizona. No, California. Holtville, California. Here we go. So right now I am just doing the finishing edits on a video that I'm going to post for you guys tomorrow. But being that this is going to be like Vlogmas, maybe it won't matter because I'm going to try to film and edit like every day. Yeah, right. That's going to be so hard. I'm thinking of like kind of just pushing these a couple days together. Because today's the second. I didn't film anything yesterday so probably gonna do like I should do it in like weeks yeah like I could film this entire week and post one through seven on Saturday that might be a little bit easier for me especially considering like things are gonna be kind of boring throughout the week so probably gonna do that but like I said editing for you guys that is my fab fit fun. So I'll probably just get that guy up tomorrow. On Saturday, I'll do Vlogmas 1 through 7 and see how that works for me. I don't know. We're going to see if I even have enough stuff. I think, I think it'll be okay.
we're gonna try it out. Do you have another video for you guys that I am currently editing? <clears throat> this one is a DIY. They're doing doggy stockings. So I'm gonna try to put that guy up at some point. I don't know. We're gonna have to see how I can do this. I'll probably do the Fab Fit Fun video tomorrow, which will be Tuesday. Throw this guy up on Thursday and then do a video Saturday doing like Vlogmas. I think that'll be the best option. Just wanna get content out for you guys, so oh and then I'm supposed to be getting like the stuff I ordered for Black Friday and Cyber Monday. I'm supposed to be getting the stuff that I ordered for Black Friday this week so I will also do a Black Friday haul for you guys I don't know if I'm gonna do a try on though it is I bought a lot of stuff <laughs> a lot of stuff so I don't know exactly if I want to do a try on yet but we'll see I'll get this all planned out for you guys and I will figure out what is the best way to go about it but for now I'm gonna go to sleep it's almost 11:30. I'm gonna have a long day tomorrow. It's gonna be a long week catching up. So I'm gonna get some sleep. And yeah, I am out for December 2nd. See you guys tomorrow. Good morning. So this is the actual day in the life of. I'm gonna show you guys how I get ready. This is pretty much the setup. I throw everything on my bed and I use this mirror to get ready. Um, listening to my motivational speeches. I've also started using this tea because one of the girls I follow on Instagram and YouTube, Danny, showed me this. She said it was really good to help her lose weight, so we're going to try it out. I tried it for a few days and then I stopped because of Thanksgiving because it makes you shit. To be honest, it makes you shit a lot, a lot, a lot, which is probably why you lose weight. Right now I'm going to fix these pieces and then pack up my lunch and make my breakfast and then we will head out to work. So last night I made a roast. Oh wow, it looks good. I'm kind of scared. I don't know how it's going to taste, but it smells really good. I put zucchini, carrot, potato, and then steak plus a sauce. So I'm going to pack some of that up for lunch. And then I think for breakfast I'm just going to make bagel just to make it easy because I'm kind of running well, I'm not running late but if I take too much time I'll be late like I should be leaving right now so I'm gonna pack up some of this and see what happens Let's see if it's any good guys it smells really good so I'm kind of hoping that that's a good sign I need to get something to get the juice out just take a small cup All right, so there is our roast. I feel like a pot roast needs some kind of bread. So I'm gonna put this on keep warm. Just leave that. Okay. I'm just gonna pack up some bread. One slice should be okay. Maybe I should put two just in case. Okay. So I packed up some bread. Maybe. And now we have a nice hearty lunch that's nice and warm. Um, if it tastes bomb, I will maybe do a little video for you guys. It's super easy. I just used... Um, a Campbell's thing. So, and then I always buy these little guys, these P3s. This is turkey, almonds, and Colby Jack cheese. These are really good to snack on. And they're super easy. Okay, so now I'm just gonna make a bagel with cream cheese and then I'm gonna get out of here. I've never tried these bagels. These are just like the Kroger brand. So hopefully these are good. If they are, I'll be very happy because they're so cheap. They smell really good.
Okay, it is lunchtime. So here is the pot roast I made. You can see all the fat on top. <laughs> it's kind of gross, but I'm gonna try it out and see if it tastes good. Here goes nothing, guys. Hopefully it tastes good. Oh. Mmm. Not too shabby. I'm gonna try the vegetables. Mmm. The zucchini tastes so good with like that pot roast sauce. I don't know why the camera just shut down on me, but I'm gonna go ahead and finish eating so I can enjoy my lunch. Hate them. It's hot. And then I guess I'll just show you guys what the rest of the day is going to be like. I cleaned up my desk area a bit. And then I kind of make a list of everything I have to do. So that's cool. I'm going to eat and I will see you guys. Okay, so I am finally off work. I'm going to take these off just because there's too much of a glare. It's dark and cold. This is how it is every time I get off. It's so freaking dark, which is why we have daylight savings here. Because, I mean, come on. <clears throat> if it was still, if it was like 6 o'clock right now, we were on Arizona time, it would just be like pitch black. And the only reason it's so bright right here is because the area that I work has like lights everywhere. Which I think is really cool. But I wanted to show you guys the surprise that we made for my best friend. Um, me, her mama, and our friend Jonathan. We all got together and got her a plane ticket to Arizona for Christmas. Because she wasn't going to be able to go down because she works Christmas Eve. And she works the day after Christmas. So it just wouldn't be like logical for her to drive all the way to Arizona. And then drive back in time to go to work. So we put in our money and we got her a plane ticket that leaves Christmas Eve at night and comes back Christmas night. That way she can be there and everything for Christmas Day or the day after Christmas to go to work. So it says from Mount Crumpet to Erica Best Friend Gowdy. I'm going to show you guys what is in here maybe. You know what? I can turn on my iPhone and see if that helps. Okay, or I could just automatically turn it off. That's so bright. It might be too bright. I don't know. Anyways, I'm just going to show you guys what it looks like really quick. So, I went ahead and I printed off this. And I just wrote her something that's very grinchy. I'm going to read it to you guys. And I'm going to turn this off because I feel like people over there can see me. And it's really creepy. So, I'm just going to read this to you guys before my camera dies. So, it says, well, hello, Erica. I know you may be sad. Not being with family on such a special day is definitely a drag. But I spoke with the Who's and your best friends too. They informed me that their Christmas wish was not to see you blue. I worked some magic with old St. Nick, and although it's early, it sure did the trick. Here are your tickets to Phoenix. I know you're probably crying. Tell Jonathan to get the Kleenex. Pack your bags and get ready to go. Don't worry about Picasso and baby. They already know. Give your friends a hug and tell your mama thank you too. Guess who your family gets to see on Christmas? That's right, it's you! Woo! And then we put like the printout of her itinerary, her flights on there as well. Hopefully you guys can see this and it's not all blurry. I honestly can't really see because I don't have my glasses on. But that is what I made her. So I can't wait to like give it to her. And I'm going to record her reaction for you guys. But for now, I want to get home because traffic is crazy. And my camera's going to die. So I will see you guys at home. I'm going to go surprise her now. Let's go. And here's Ayla. Ayla got a new bed this weekend. She loves it. What? Yeah, same time. These are my roommates, as per usual. Hi. Hello. Hi. Why you gotta look like that? <laughs> so, I saw something else in the mail today. What'd you see? This. What is 
to this. You guys are making me uncomfortable. What's going on? Read it out loud for all of us, no. please. <laughs> Wait, this is this. Who's this from? Just read it. <laughs> I'm so shy. Oh. <laughs> Look behind it. Mm -hmm. No, no, just this. Excited? Yeah. Good morning. Day three. No, four. Um, so every morning when I wake up, I get up and I make my bed. Because to me, making your bed every morning is a small step in doing something good for yourself. It makes you feel good when you come home to a clean bed. I am finally home from work. I look greasy, I don't know why, but <clears throat> I wanted to show you guys. Cody got me a new tripod because I broke mine, so I'm very excited about this. I can't wait to open it up and use it and throw out my broken one. And then I also got my big old package from forever. Guys, there is so much stuff in here. I bought so much stuff for Black Friday, but I want to do a full like Black Friday haul for you guys. So I don't want to show you guys everything that's in there, but I will definitely be doing a haul. Friday? Ooh, or maybe this weekend. Probably this weekend, because then I'll have better lighting and everything, and my room will be clean and all my laundry will be done. So we'll film the Black Friday haul for you guys this weekend. I'm also going to be filming a video tomorrow and it's going to be I only eat one color for 24 hours so I will be excited to film that I'll have that one up for you guys at some point I'm thinking next week so I have a video coming out tomorrow for vlogmas I'm gonna have a video every single week on Saturdays but I did a video on Tuesday I'll have a video tomorrow on Thursday then I'll have a video Saturday. Then next week it'll be the same thing. I'll post a video Tuesday, Thursday, Saturday. And then after that it'll probably just be like Saturday. Because I can't keep up with all those videos. But I wanted to at least get some content out to you guys. And I have a lot of stuff to film. So I was like, why not? But we'll see how that goes. For now, I'm just going to go ahead and go through this stuff and try it on. Because I'm really excited. And uh, yeah, waiting for Jonathan to get home because we have some dollar store adventures planned because we're going to DIY our Christmas decorations. So, very excited about that. But for now, I'm gonna try on so my stuff. So we left all the dollar stores in Walmart. I picked out one of my old boxes and realized I had garland, so that's kind of annoying. But we got stockings and then we got a bunch of stuff to do DIY stiff. And then, we got this really cool light that does all this. Look at it, it's so cute. And then I got Christmas stuff. And then Ayla got a new toy. I'm so happy with the new toy. I should already fucking Oh my God. <laughs> Ayla, this is supposed to be triple stitch so you couldn't break through. Yeah. Thank you, toy. <laughs> 
Yep, that's Ayla. I don't know how this thing has survived so long. <laughs> she rips the con out like more and more every single day. This was once a bunny. <laughs> <laughs> this is why Ayla loves Uncle Jonathan more than me. <laughs> She's so happy. She get toy to play. <sighs> Ella, you kind of made a mess in here, dude. I know. <laughs> we started to decorate. Right now, we're currently making DIY. Yeah. <laughs> For our garland and our stockings. And those are Erica's Jesus socks. <laughs> Oh, and update on Ayla's toy. <laughs> <laughs> she destroyed it. Ayla. <laughs> this is our finished product for tonight. We're still going to add some stuff. I want to create a little light post here. And then maybe put something down there. We'll see. But this is what we did. And since I can't put music because of YouTube, I'll sing to you guys. It's beginning to look a lot like Christmas. Christmas. <laughs> Everywhere you go. Beautiful. like I get time to myself I get like an hour and 45 minutes to two hours to just kind of like be in my own thoughts and chill and think about stuff but at the same time it's like sometimes I just want to stay in the office and chill out and not have to drive everywhere you know as you guys saw we did do our Christmas decorations not all of them we just started doing some we're gonna make some more I have found this really cute like snowman idea that I wanted you to put on our bar I always put something on our bar because I just think it looks cute farmland out here but anyways patience positivity no patience persistence and positivity and I explained like what they meant to me and basically what it means to me is for patience anything that you do in this world you have to have patience it's not going to come easy it's not going to come the first time around it's not going to be you know something that just gets handed to you and if it does it's probably not worth it because whatever you want in this world you have to work for which is why I also like persistence whatever you're doing in this world again not gonna come easy you have to constantly come 
so I just left one of the client sites. I'm getting a bite to eat and then I have to go to another client site. But this is what I tried. I've never had it before. I don't even know where they have rallies at. I'm in Calexico right now. So there's definitely one out here. But it's surprisingly not bad. I mean, I'm probably going to feel like shit after. But it tastes good going down. I've got mozzarella sticks. And then a chicken box that has like little popcorn chicken looking things and french fries. All of this was like five bucks. I couldn't pack a lunch because when I'm on the road, I don't have any place to store it. So, unfortunately, when I do my client on sites in uh, Centro, I have to eat out. I don't have to. I could technically use their fridges, but I just feel weird, you know? So, here I am eating out. But hopefully, I'm going to turn this down. I don't want to get copyright. Right. I'm going to finish this up. Then I have to head to the next client. Now I can finally go home. Alright, so now we're making dinner. Jonathan's making like a stir fry thing. We made some chicken and some au gratin potatoes. And now I'm going to try to make my Nana's pumpkin cookie recipe. I'll show you guys that. But we're going to make it. And then... I got some little chocolate chips for Jonathan's batch. Mm. It's gonna have pumpkin and chocolate chip. So I already did all the dry ingredients, now I have the butter, sugar, and pumpkin. Also very important to make the icing, you need to get powdered sugar, confectionery syrup, or whatever you want to call it, and evaporated milk. Just put it into a little bag and I usually just kind of squeeze this until all of the powdered sugar is mixed in. And you want it to be the consistency of icing. And this is the finished product. These are the Nana ones. These are the new ones I made that have chocolate chips in them for Jonathan. Don't they look so good? I'm so excited to eat them. I'm gonna sign off for tonight. Tomorrow might be my last day of filming or I might film Saturday. We'll see. I wanna get this video up on Saturday so I might not film Saturday. I might film Saturday and put it in the next week. But I am currently doing laundry, so. I need to hang that stuff up but I want to show you guys what I just put up I just put up my new saying that I got on Amazon for like five bucks so cute looks like this it looks so cute 
I can't wait to show you guys my full room once it's all done. There's like a few things I still need to do, like obviously clean again, but I want to get like curtains for my little window and pictures. I don't know. There's a few things that need to be done before I do a full on room tour for you guys, but I'm very excited for it. But for now, I'm going to go ahead and hang up my clothes, watch a little TV, and get ready for bed. And then tomorrow, we will film again. Good morning. Happy Saturday. This is the last day that I'm going to be filming for this week of vlogmas today i'm actually going to give you guys the winners but i want to look better than this i thought oh it's going to be such a nice day i'm going to film everything in the daytime am i even clear but then i looked outside and i was like oh it's raining again so anyways i'm about to make my bed as i do every morning and then i was also thinking i'm like oh, every time i come on here when i'm like vlogging or something you guys see me in a j cole shirt but then i thought if you look at my Spotify decade list or whatever, J. Cole was my number one played person this year. So I was like, oh, that makes sense. I also have been like really not wanting to show you guys this, but I'm going to show you guys what I'm dealing with. I need to hang up all the clothes I washed. I have shit everywhere right now. Like everywhere. This is all getting cleaned today because I unpacked when I came back from Arizona and I just kind of like threw shit places. When I tell you my room is normally clean, I mean it. This is a mess. I'm gonna clean this now, then I'm gonna shower, get ready so I can film my winners. And if you guys have made it this far to the end of the video, thank you guys so much for watching. It makes me so happy. It's a long video, but it's a whole week, so I'll see you guys when I look less disgusting okay guys moment of truth we're gonna go ahead and pick the winner to the contest i literally am just going into this commentpicker.com i'll show you guys that and it's just entering in your youtube url for the video that you want to pick the random comment for so that's what i'm gonna do let me get the url i'll show you guys everything i'm doing also so you guys don't think that i'm lying so go to my videos and we'll go to the whole video and we'll copy the code can you guys see that hopefully you guys can see that okay and then we will just put that video here and it's just filter duplicate users do you guys see that so we're gonna go ahead and just get YouTube comments amount of comments 51 okay now it says start raffle oh my god my nails busted boom winner is stacy g let's see what her comment said i'm thankful for my two daughters my husband my mom and my grandma they have been there for me always and my mom and grandma have been such an inspiration to me i love your videos you're awesome and real and beautiful p.s girl what eyelashes are those thank you so much you're so nice thank you so much stacy so stacy g is the winner you guys stacy if you're watching this please reach out to me um i don't know if youtube still does like the messages maybe i'll just reach out to you I'll reach out to you. I will reach out to you and find a way to contact you to get your information so I can send you the package, which I have already pre-packaged, put a little note in there and everything, so I just need to get it filled out with your information and I can get that shipped out to you next week. Thank you guys so much to everybody who entered my contest. It really does mean the most to me that you guys actually care to still watch my videos, enter my contests, and all of that fun stuff. Plus, it was really nice reading all the things you guys are thankful for. I know you may not believe it, but I did sit there and read all of the comments because I was like, oh, this is so nice knowing what people are thankful for, what we're grateful for. It's super important to never take for granted anything that we have in this world because it could be gone in the blink of an eye. So I just wanna say thank you guys so much 
much for participating in my giveaway and if you made it this far in the video thank you guys so much for watching this entire vlogmas i hope it was fun i hope it was entertaining like i said my days are pretty boring monday through friday i'm at work so there's really not much going on after work i kind of just relax with my roommates or whatever so hopefully this was exciting and if it was please give this video a huge thumbs up it lets me know that you guys want to see vlogmas week two and thank you guys again so much for watching i really appreciate it if you're not subscribed to my channel definitely hit the subscribe button and hit the notification bell if you want to be alerted anytime i post especially if you want to see all my vlogmas is this month up until christmas thank you guys again and i love you guys have an amazing day